Well, everybody, this is Gary. Today is Wednesday, July 31st, 2019. It's 1 18 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in the United States in Rochester, New York. This is my coping with schizophrenia update. I'm doing better today than I did yesterday. Yesterday was pretty rough. I was having paranoia, anxiety, fear, hallucinations, um, delusions, paranoia. Um, but that's all starting to ease up a little bit. It never entirely goes away, but it's better today than it was yesterday. I've been getting out and doing more recreational things um, since last night and this morning, and I thought I'd stop for a minute and make this video. Um, like I said, I'm doing better than I was. Sometimes the only thing you can do when you're feeling bad is wait it out. Force yourself through your daily routine, and it is important to have a daily routine, um, even work if possible. Um, I do lots of different stuff to cope with my uh, schizophrenia as far as routines go. I write poetry for allpoetry.com. I do YouTube videos like this one, either on politics or my own mental health, or mental health in general, or religion, or other opinion pieces. Um, I uh, ride my bike when I can. Today's nice out. It's kind of hot for Rochester, New York. It's about 80 degrees outside, and the sun's pretty strong today. Um, so I went out to breakfast this morning, and I was sweating like a pig, and it was only like 8 a.m. in the morning. It was already getting hot. Um, but uh, at least I got out of the house today, and that's important, too. Spending too much time alone has been a problem for me, and um, that can just lead to really, really bad anxiety because you're just going through your own head without talking to other people. And your thoughts just start spinning around and around. So it's important to actually be around other people when you can. Not necessarily all the time. We all like to have um, downtime and spend some time alone doing whatever we do. Read a book or watch a movie or whatever. Listen to music. Um, and I do those things when I'm alone. But I also learned since yesterday that it's important to be around other people. If you're not talking to other people, you're going to find yourself caught up in your own head and your own thoughts. And you're not getting any feedback on what reality really is. Um, when you have friends and you talk to other people around you, you can either directly or indirectly verify what you're seeing, hearing, and believing, believing is true. For example, if I'm paranoid and I think somebody's following me, if I actually ask a friend of mine, are people following me? They'll probably say no, and then I'll know the truth. Um, paranoia is a distortion of reality, and being around other people can... Um, clear that up at least for some people so um i'm doing better today tomorrow i have an appointment with my psychiatrist and um i haven't been to the psychiatric hospital since sunday of earlier this week so um but i have an appointment tomorrow that was already scheduled like two weeks ago excuse me i'm going to keep the appointment tomorrow with my psychiatrist and we're going to go over my medications again see if something needs to be changed. Um, but I'm doing better today. Comment, like, subscribe.